Good morning, all. It's the Devious Monkey here. It is Wednesday morning. I don't have any clean dishes or silverware. So I'm doing... I was going to say I'm doing laundry. Jesus. Same thing. I'm doing the dishes, running the dishwasher, and just don't feel like dealing with anything. And since I have no plates or all and that shit, I'm just going to go to breakfast and get started with my day. It is very cool out right now. It's only 66 degrees. I think it's only supposed to get just a tad bit over 70. We'll see if that actually happens. So far, it's a decent day out though. I, I guess it's supposed to be cloudy, mostly cloudy, whatever. And Oh man, there's a shit ton of geese over there, all eating in grass and probably pooping. Yeah. Okay, so today is going to be kind of a low-key day. I have one package coming that I'm aware of, and that is the additional battery that I ordered yesterday when I found out they didn't give me a battery like they were supposed to. That's the only thing that's coming today. Otherwise, I'm going to use today as a loose end day, meaning I'm going to be tying up some loose ends. It's the perfect way to get that shit done, obviously for day job. Otherwise, I also have to remember that I need to call the plumber. I keep forgetting to call the plumber that I picked. I called the original plumber that I picked and got that wonky ass message and didn't feel comfortable with that. So I'm going with a legitimate company that got a shit ton of five star reviews and I'm going to give them a call and see what's up. Now, the other thing that I have decided and I've gone back and forth on this, but I don't want to put our brand new faucet onto the shitty stained, ugly white sink that's in there now. I want to have them install a new sink as well. So I decided, well, I'll just get a stainless steel sink and I'll be done with it. And I read a bunch of reviews and people complained that it got scratched and, and discolored and some said it rusted. And I'm thinking to myself, okay, well, that does kind of suck because you're buying a brand new sink and, you know, it, it's going to get rusted. But I also realized that it's a freaking sink. You're throwing dirty dishes and silverware and shit into it. Of course it's going to get scratched. Jesus. So, I don't know. I, I have then thought that, all right, I'll get one of those, like, black... I don't even know if it's ceramic or whatever kind of a thing for a little bit more money. But there were people that said that that discolored as well. And I'm thinking to myself, you know what? For under 150 bucks, I can have a freaking stainless steel sink thrown in there, you know, and then I already have the faucet. And just get that done. And the worst that happens is that it gets rusted and it gets scratched. I don't think it's going to get rusted to the point that it's going to rush through, but either way, it's 150 bucks. I'm not spending $500 on a sink that's going to discolor anyways. And I'm definitely not going to spend over $1,500 as some of those damn things cost. Hell no. So I'm going to go to Home Depot. I'm probably going to buy a sink and like the, you know, assorted shit that gets attached to in the, the, the drain portions and probably spend, well, I will spend under $200 and then I'll have the sink the faucet, I'll call the plumber, have them come, install that damn thing, and then the kitchen's done. That's pretty much what I've got planned for today. So, let's go eat. Next step is done. I just went to Home Depot and I bought a sink. It's a Kohler. It's supposed to have, like, noise suppression technology built into it and all that shit. I bought one side, with, like the strainer for the one side, that doesn't have the garbage disposal. But as far as the garbage disposal, I have no freaking idea what kind of garbage disposal we have, what size it is, and it all wasn't very clear what I needed to get. So I'm gonna wait for the plumber to tell me all that shit. So I'm gonna go home now, dump that shit off, and then I'm gonna call the plumber and try to get that scheduled. I'm sure there's a thousand other things that I'm forgetting to do, and I'll just start checking them off the list that I haven't written down, which is why I can't remember jack shit. Let's go home and schedule a plumber. No surprise, on my way back to Home Depot, I got a hold of the plumber and I'm shocked that he's gonna do it tomorrow at some point. He hasn't gotten back to me yet, but he asked me to take pictures of everything. He asked me some questions. I sent him the pictures and all that shit. And he suggested that I go back to Home Depot and, and get the part I need. Now what I need is called the in-sync aerator. It's the piece that goes in the drain but connects up to the garbage disposal. So it's different from the side that I bought. Now I opened up the new sink and measured the hole and verified it's three and a half inch. And the drain that I got for the other side says it fits 
standard three and a half or four inch openings of new sinks. So got that going for me. It shouldn't be hard to go back and, and get that. I mean, I already had it in my hand, but I wasn't sure if that's what I needed. So I didn't want to get it. Probably should have, would have saved myself a trip because I think I grabbed the right part, but better safe than sorry. And it's not like I'm not used to going back to stores a thousand times, Target, Trader Joe's. So yeah, I'm gonna head there now and take care of that. Then tonight, before I go to bed, I will make sure that all the counters are cleared off so that they can do what they gotta do. And, you know, I have, still have no idea when he's showing up. So I guess I'll be sitting there all day, but that's a good thing because I need to sit there and do some day job shit anyways. So, all right, I gotta run in there and buy that piece and I'll be right back. Parts bought? Still don't know if I got what I'm supposed to get. At worst comes to worst, I don't need it and I can take it back. I'm gonna just wrap this up right now and say tomorrow will be interesting since I have no idea if and when the plumber's coming, but at least we can get our kitchen done with the exception of the electrical shit. So that's it. That's all I've got for you today. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. As always, thanks for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember, kids, forward and up.